Hey, this is Jake Ritigliano, and welcome to another reaction video. This time it's Penny the Woo in A Nightmare on Who Street. You can watch the original video in the link below. Let's begin. Eeyore is his friend, and Kaya and Little Roo. There's Rabbit and Piglet, and there's all, but most of all, Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. Tubby the Tubby, all stuffed with fluff. He's Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. It was a typical night at Christopher Robin's house. Yeah, it was. Mom, I want to see the new episode of Slasher Theater. But the last time Christopher Robin liked not wanting to watch that program, mm -hmm. he says, you'll get nightmares anyway. <laughs> That's what she thinks. <laughs> Oh, is it the Pink Panther? <laughs> God damn it, I shouldn't have stayed in bed. Come on, Christopher Robin. You're just in time. You can say that again. I'm looking forward to Slasher Theater's latest movie. I went. Anyway, Tigger is going to watch the movie with us. Well, I all right. Jim as long as Tigger doesn't try to get me in trouble again. <laughs> Hey, what are we watching tonight? <laughs> We're watching the latest episode of Slasher Theater. Yeah, I love horror movies. 90 minutes later. Okay, Pickett, you can come out now the movie's over. I still don't see why Mrs. Stevenson didn't use a cell phone. That's because cell phones weren't invented yet, dumbass. <laughs> Can we please order some pizza? But don't you think it's too late to eat <coughs> pizza? No. Jesus oh. Christ, okay, I'll order pizza. Hello, is this Momo Luigi's? Look, Kim, we're closing in about 10 minutes, so can you call back tomorrow? I'm really sorry, sir. I have a, I have a very large sausage and pepperoni pizza with lots and lots of bacon and don't be stingy with the breadsticks. Did you just hear what I freaking said? I said we're closing in 10 minutes. Okay, that okay. That wasn't me. That was And I would like to have a very small Coca-Cola, please. <laughs> <laughs> Your ass to the manager. For the little Walt Disney hang up the goddamn phone now. <laughs> oh, God. You know what, you little son of a bitch? I don't care about this dead end job anymore. I'm gonna come over there and I'm gonna kill you and your mom and your stupid magical talking stuffed animals. You're dead. You hear me? Dead. Oh, God. Well, here's another nice mess you've got me into. You really shouldn't have pissed off that employee. Tigger, I wouldn't worry about that. Besides, how does he even know where we live? Becky the babysitter has a part-time job there. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I just had a thought. What is this, Piglet? What if he tries to climb into this room? Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> this is getting us nowhere at all. I say we catch that would be killer and turn him over to the police. And we're going to do so home alone style. Oh. <laughs> and so, Christopher oh. Robin, Woo Piglet, Tigger, and for some reason Eeyore, are on the hunt to capture the killer pizza boy. <laughs> Come on, you guys. Don't mind to scare me. Oh, Tigger, that wasn't me. <laughs> oh. Did you guys see that? God damn it, we should have stayed at home. <laughs> I'm sure it's a good idea to have Piglet look for that pizza boy. Well, what could possibly go wrong? You who, pizza boy? Are you out there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Where's the fire, Piglet? He's out to get me. The pizza boy? Nope. It's just our old friend and overall silly dog who Joe. Well, I knew that. The day all this stupid kid Christopher Robin and his magical stuffed animals who brain calling me. Oh, you little maggot. Well, that's a twist. Oh, but officer, I can explain. This? Christopher Robin and the gang were sentenced to one month in jail and misdemeanor charges, but not before Christopher Robin's mother paid for their bail. Well, I certainly hope you and your friends learned your lesson about staying up all night. I'll go see who that is. Uh, good evening. We're here to inspect the uh, wiring and the switches. Uh, we're from the electric company. And it's for your own safety. I'm sorry, but we're not buying or selling at this door. Good night. <coughs> I swear, some people have no decency these days. 
I gotta admit, that cameo from Jasper and Horace was very unexpected. What do you think of it? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks, goodbye. This is me signing off.